Yeah, it's been incredible. I've I've worked hard. It's just especially by giving my chance against Man City. I didn't really, I didn't think it was gonna happen, but manager manager just told me the day before and just put me in. And going back going back to my house just that same night, I was like, I struggled to go to sleep a little bit, but I was just more. I wasn't really nervous. I was more confident. I was thinking, I've, if I play well, this is my chance. I can stay in around the first team. I just got to take it. I don't know if I can describe uh, before. Is it before, nervous? Is it excitement? No, yeah, it was more excitement. It wasn't really nervous. And only when I was nervous, maybe the first second, as walking under the pitch, I was like, not even when they went to warm up after that, as like before the whistle went. I was thinking, ah, what am I going to do? How am I going to play? So I just telling myself, make sure the first thing I do is 100% and then that will get me going from there. And I knew, so I'm playing against World Cup players, players that have won everything, Aguero, Sterling, players that are involved in a lot. I just knew I did to do well. Even though we lost, it wasn't a great result, but I think I did alright. For about two days, three days, I felt it, because I didn't... I didn't want to lose that game at all. Well, I don't want to lose any game, but especially that game, Derby and the FA Cup. Yeah. All credit to them, they are a great team, but... Especially the, the, the second goal, I reckon... Not completely, not completely my fault, but it was... I was involved. I should have overcovered more, but it happened. I learned more, I learned more from that game than playing against City. It sounds it sound bad, but I, learned, I definitely learned more. Start of the pre-season, I was thinking of who was ahead of me, and like, had, I've always had that, like, at the back of my mind. I spoke to Martin, Martin Hunter, that used to be here, and he told me like, you've got a good chance of being in the round the first team to, before the end of the season. So from then, I thought I'm going to work as hard as I can. And then it got, as as time went on, I, I was scoring, I was scoring in the 18s, then went up to the 23s, playing well, and just got given my chance. Yeah. He's, he's always trying to, no matter what you, no matter how you train, no matter how you, what you do, he just always wants to just push young players. He said that he's got loads of like, trust in young players and he wants to just mature us into like, men because they, they're, they're the next generation. This club is it's wonderful, everything, everything they do and how they do it, Southampton has really pushed me and here I feel like I'm able to push harder and harder and show my experience that I've, like, I feel like I'm more of an experienced player. Because they know, they, they know, they say you've got your one, you've got one for talent, but just make sure you always use it. Yeah, they almost sort of put their arm around you. And... Yeah, they're more like they're like push, they're pushing me. They're, even on the pitch, like Pierre, like Hoiberg, he makes sure he knows I understand. He doesn't want, he just wants me to be on it all the time. Mm -hmm. Like just n never, don't, don't drop off. 